are, Tom. It's a, a free-flowing conversation, yeah. but they actually segment them, and we're now in segment three of our show. So is this where I get my parking validated? Yeah. Okay. It's, it's really something that I hope people can understand that everyone comes, not everyone. You know, some people are born with kind of the... What do they call it? The, the, the golden slipper. Yeah, silver know, spoon or something Silver like spoon, that. Yeah, yeah, all that. Yeah. Some people are born with that. Even then, they have to run up against mm-hmm. something where it just doesn't go the way you think it's going to go sure. or the way you want it to go. And sometimes you got to let go and let this kind of creative spark inside of you. That's what that's what kicked in. Is yeah, that that's exactly what You tapped what into yeah. your creator, your yeah. creative spark. Yeah. You said, what am I going to do? And it's got to be different. Right. And it's right. got to be organic and authentic. And that was you. Mm-hmm. You put. I could never do that, for instance. Yeah. I could never follow that path. I, I, could, I, can't, I would draw Bambi in the back of TV Guide <laughs> and submit it for <laughs> right. Yeah. They, would, they took anyone. Those. They yeah. took anyone in that art school. Yeah, the right. pirate, <laughs> the turtle, <laughs> the yeah. pirate turtle. Uh, and I would, uh, but I could never, I could never draw, and I always admire people that do that. And I think that's a, that's something also. I hope people p- p- get from both of us: stay diverse, stay abundant, have no lid on your career right. on what you want right. to do. Right. I I really believe that uh, there's so much Hollywood does this to a labeling. That's a stand-up comic. Oh sure. That's a host. Oh sure. Yeah. They don't know you as a great actor. Yeah. I saw you in something. I think it was a, you might have played a postman or something. Oh, the like, messenger. The messenger. We did that with my friend Ben Shelton. Yeah. Brilliant. You were yeah. a brilliant performer. Thank you. Brilliant actor. He was a he was a person a burnout who was delivering envelopes yeah. to people. Yeah. And in the envelope was the exact time they were going to die. Oh. And Jean Smart did it with me. Yeah. Yeah. She was in it. And she's brilliant. She's doing too. okay. <laughs> <laughs> she's doing okay. Brilliant. Yeah. Yeah. She's on the show Hacks. Yeah, I know. Yeah. And do you know who the the girl is in that show? Do you know who no. her mother is? Yeah. You've seen the show Hacks. Yeah, right? I saw the first. I haven't seen since the first season. I oh, catch up. it is that that girl is so. T- well, of course, Gene Smart is, yeah, but the girl yeah. is, plays the writer, uh, comedian. Mm-hmm. It's it's a uh, Hannah Einbinder. I've known her since she was born, and it's Lorraine Newman's daughter. No kidding. A lot of people don't know that. No, yeah. I did not know Lorraine that. Lorraine Newman, original cast of Saturday Night Live, and she is in and and her. Her dad's really talented, Chad Einbinder as well. But wow, can she act? Yeah. yeah. I, do you? Do you just love talent? Yes. When you see talent. Yes. I, I've always admired you. As a matter of fact, when I lose parts to somebody, and it's somebody like you, uh, Jim Carrey got in Living Color. You know, I mean, I've been up for so many things. Mm-hmm. Uh, Seinfeld, I was in for that for yeah. Roy Kramer. I mean, could you picture anyone else as Kramer? <laughs> no, no. Yeah, yeah. And I, I did, but I love to see talent. I have no envy for it. I just have an admiration mm-hmm. for it. You know, mm-hmm. when you when you mm-hmm. see those people, you just go, wow. Yeah. They're really in their moment. They're they're in their creativity and mm-hmm. they're in their body. They're organic yeah. and authentic. And I, I just think I, it's, it's that term of flow. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I call it genuine energy flow. Yep, yep. You're in that flow, and there can be any impediments. If you're in that flow, there, it's, it's a river, and yeah. it's flowing. It yeah. rocks and dams. Yeah. There's all these things that happen, but you just keep flowing. And that's what you did when you saw the pig fetus. Yeah, it really, I mean, yeah. that was the motivation. That was yeah. like the, okay, all right, Tom. <laughs> yeah. Let's put it together here. You right. know, and and I started think it started firing. The synapses woke up. Yeah, they wake you up. Know, yeah. yeah, and then you're just tapped in. You're dialed in. You're in presence. Your mindfulness. Yeah. You're, okay. And now that I'm just radio show yeah. that I got as a result of doing the cross country led to, series led to me uh, getting TV jobs in Boston because oh. the the coverage area of that station in wow. Portsmouth, New Hampshire, got into the Boston market or north of the Boston market where some people who worked at TV stations. We're listening. You never know who's you watching. Never you never know. know who's listening. Yeah. Someone could be seeing this and going, Tom Bergeron, I have a show idea. Eh, I'm, we're, done. We're I'm done. Celebrities are in squares. Oh, okay. Well, <laughs> that was fun. But I got to tell you, in all honesty, yeah, I, I don't want to host anymore. I, I, I've kind of been there, done that. I, got, I get that. Yeah. I get that. Yeah. Believe it or not, and I'm at the highest level, and you were at the highest level, yeah. I, I, stand up. I mean, I'm getting standing ovations almost every show. I, I've never, and I'm not just blowing smoke. I've told you this before. Huh. Never laughed as hard as when I watched your what? performance. Oh, That's wow. When I, when you I, mean I, of any comedians? Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Well, I, came, I think it was uh, uh, with the comedy uh, comic strip or something in New York. Oh, Caroline's. Yeah, Caroline. Helen. It was Caroline's. You came yes. with Helen. Yes. 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 Yeah, but I had seen you before that in right. the Hollywood Squares days. Sure. And you, I I just died. Well, I didn't literally die laughing, or I wouldn't be doing this. <laughs> but brilliant. And I don't want to do it anymore. See? Yeah, yeah I get it. I so get it. I definitely don't want to go on 
go get in another airplane. Yeah. That's so that's tire. That's right. tiring. Right. Done. You know, just done. Mm-hmm. I like this. Yeah. By the way. Yeah. How easy is this? And by the way, our time is up. <laughs> but we're just getting I'm, started. I'm the messenger. I'm talking. <laughs> yeah, you are. Your, that's your, right. Your the envelope. Oh, your, ow. Oh, your time yeah, is up. Yeah. And that's how fast it goes when yeah. you're when you're in flow. Mm-hmm. And you and mm-hmm. I are in flow. I mean, we got. I mean. We could we could go a number of different places because we have all of these experiences, these tangential places that we've gone. Right. Also, parallel universes they yeah. intersect now and then, and then they don't. Yeah. But there's these people that just you know they ring true to me. You're one of them. Whoopi's one of them. They're people that just all of those years later, it's still. As a matter of fact, our next guest was well, supposed to be a different day, but I, oh, I'll, I'll let you right. know how the sausage is made. Here. Yeah. <laughs> we, we, when you watched Hollywood Squares years ago, all done in the same day. <laughs> the same day. Yeah. <laughs> I hosted a show. They did like six episodes in a day. It was called My Generation, yeah. and it was the first virtual reality show. I was in green screen all day. Oh. I was in I was in Kermit's colon <laughs> for hours at a time. And I would wake up at night going you know, to my wife, you want to go for the bonus? We got a bonus round. Yeah, I mean, it made me so nuts. And one after another after another. I think my takeaway from this whole experience is going to be the phrase, I was in Kermit's colon. <laughs> <laughs> it, was, it was quite an experience. We've had so many really unique experiences. And, of course, they should all go in a book. But no one really can understand yeah. that well, pr- the process that it takes. Yeah. And then you get somewhere, and then you get humbled all right, the time. Right. I mean, I was Hollywood Squares. It was a dream for me. I was again. I wanted to be Paul Lynn to be my father. Yeah, I thought yeah. we'd be the first father and son team. I like Craig and Paul with Lynn for the win, please. And there, there I was. But I'm not a big celebrity. I was always Craig Shoemaker to block. <laughs> <laughs> One time I'm looking at the monitor. I'm the only way to go. She's, I'll take Antonio Banderas for the yeah, loss. Right, right. <laughs> you know, anything but pronounce Shoemaker, which is people make a mocker. They make a mockery out of me. Oh. I well, hope listen, this I was got, good I therapy got, for you, I, too. I got, well, I, here's some testosterone for you, okay? All right, thank from, you. From Biotech. Thank you. And, uh, Maybe you... I'll give it to my doctor. He was jealous of mine. <laughs> <laughs> well, I love it. He's a pass it on kind of guy. Yeah, yeah. Here you go. Tom. Thanks, buddy. Well, I'll, I'll give you something else you might need. They have another one for memory. So, you re- so officially, we'll hear it here, not for the first time, I'm sure, but you officially retire from hosting. From hosting, yeah. I'll, I'm open to other, like William Shatner and I came up with a story that has been turned into a screenplay by two extremely talented uh, writers, uh, Katie Keene and uh, Marla Sokoloff. Nat Bernstein oh, I know has come in as our partner on this. Yeah. And a production company optioned the screenplay, and uh, their option runs out in a few months. So you better get your ass in gear. Mm, um, mm. But yes, but that's, you know, I, growing up as a fan of like Star Trek, I never mm. thought I'd work on a story with Shatner. Wow. You know? I got to show you my cartoon. I have a cartoon. It makes fun. It's pigs in space. <laughs> oh, I'm not pigs. Sorry. Pigs. No, it's chickens. Chickens who are doing uh, the Ch- Enterprise? Ch- yeah, it's, it's called This is Chicken Ship. <laughs> and it's chickens in space okay. with Co- Colonel Peckhard. <laughs> Okay. All right. Make it so number one. That's a next gen thing. Yeah. yeah the next okay. Gen, yeah. The next generation's chickens, yeah. and yeah. their nemesis is like bat ship crazy, <laughs> cow ship, dog ship. Okay. It's a, cool. I've got. I have to show you the cartoon. All right. We're out of time. Okay. Oh, my God, Tom. A All pleasure. Right. I'm going to do this for the first time. We've had amazing guests, Oscar winners. We've had in here. I'm going to say you come back right away. I would love to. Yeah, just to continue I the conversation. Yeah. We have so much more. I'm going to teach you more about radio. Yeah, good. <laughs> good. I'm still not going to wear the headphones. Though. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Tom Bergeron is our special guest today on Still Standing Up, and I hope you're still standing up. I need a, I need an outro, by yeah, the way. I still yeah, don't have yeah, one. Yeah. we got to get a How little. How about sit your ass down? <laughs> <laughs> sit your ass down. However you listen to us or watch us. We're available on all of the the above. Yeah, yeah all, the, <laughs> all of so those bad. trendy so, things. I'm so you bad can at find this. Craig. You know what it is? It's like I just like connecting with people. Yeah. You've got to do the the maintenance right. stuff, which you had to do for oh, years. years with and all years. of those shows. Yeah. It's maintenance stuff. Yeah. It's like rehearsed lines, or they're up on a teleprompter. You read it, you do it well. Yeah. But in the meantime, you're going. I just looking for some human connection mm-hmm. here, and that's what we mm-hmm. had today. I hope you got a lot out of it. Tom had a turnaround as well. Craig Shoemaker had plenty of turnarounds. More to come when you tune us in. You can't even use tune anymore. I don't think people <laughs> tune. The, they the sh- they don't know, tune. This is like stumbling at the finish line. That's, I, I, I'm stumbling. <laughs> it is. It was going so well. It was done. It, it was, was done. Like, I had an out. I, hey, I our special guest I today. Right. And that's the other thing. It's like that's old I, score. I special just, guest today. I ran you, a you, heartbreak you, hill. You wrap it up. <laughs> that reminds me of the marathon. I ran a marathon, but yeah. I was the only one sponsored by Marlboro Light. <laughs> 
I, sp- I hid them in a tree. I hid my cigarettes, and at the end, I stumbled. I couldn't make it the last point six. It's yeah, another co- point kind of like right now. I could not make it. I don't, oh my! God, I thought I was gonna die, and then I then I found those cigarettes. And I had cigarettes oh. after the after the thing. I didn't study for that yeah. one. Like I didn't study for this. Well, wh- I was gonna say, welcome to the show. <laughs> That's how bad it is. Yeah. I am stumbling. All right, keep all this. Keep oh, all yeah. this. Don't, don't edit. This is gold. This, this, no, I would say, fool's gold. <laughs> fool's gold. You know they called yeah. that Micah when we were kids. Yeah, didn't they? It was Micah. Tor- remember Micah Torrance? I do not. Sheriff on the rifle. Talk about stumble. Now, <laughs> now you're going to stump me yeah. in the stumble. In the stumble. Oh, go give me a trivia question. I don't know. I have zero idea. <laughs> Micah. Oh, was Micah that the Torrance. rifleman? He, yeah, the rifleman, Chuck Connors. He <laughs> was. He was the sheriff. There you go. We'll end on that. See All right, ne- sit see your ass time. down. See you next time. Still standing. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be honest with you. This has gone by so fast. That was just a little bit of a just a little bit of a bit. Yeah, and I'm exhausted yeah, already. I, 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 I am. I, I am think too. I need some free testosterone. <laughs> here, you might want to chug the bottle. <laughs> it is free, by the way. Oh, is that right? For you. Yeah. Here okay, you go. Thank you so much. All right.